Hey, how's it going? Today, I'll show you how to get this amazing and, by the way, totally free IPC player to your Fire Stick or Android TV. The whole process is super easy and will take you only a couple of minutes. And this player works both with Embryo links as well as Xtreme codes, so that's pretty nice. And now, without any further ado, let me show you how to get that app to your device. First of all, you'll have to get an app code and loader to your Fire Stick. You can actually get it totally for free from the official Amazon App Store. To so, we just go to search on your device and start typing downloader in the search bar. And now, as you can see, downloader has already popped out for us at the bottom. So there was even no need to enter the whole name of the app. Now we click on downloader and there's the app that you need to get to your device. But after you got downloader, it is not over yet. We'll still have to set it up. So in order to actually set up the loader, we need to go to the settings on your Forestic device, which are right here. So click on that button with the gear icon, then scroll down and go to My Fire TV. Let's open it. And from here, we'll have to turn on the developer options on your device. But on some Fire Sticks, and especially on the new Fire Stick devices, the developer options can be hidden by default. So if that's the case, and you cannot find the developer options anywhere, no need to worry, it's really easy to make them appear. Just go to about, select Fire TV Stick, and now you'll have to click on the middle button on your remote for 7 times, and do it fast, so let's do it. And as you can see now for me at the bottom it says no need, you are already a developer. That's in my case, and in your case it's going to say that you have become a developer now. So we go back, go to developer options, install, sorry, turn on ADB debugging, then go to install unknown apps, from here locate the loader and turn that option on. So what it does is going to allow you to install other applications from the internet and not necessarily only those apps which are only available in the official Amazon App Store by default. And that's exactly what we're going to do right now. So now finally let's go to the list of apps on your device which is right here, let's open it, and now here you'll find a loader, which is set up and ready to use on your device. But before actually using the loader, there's one important thing to do, which is of course connecting to a VPN. In my case, I mostly use NordVPN, because they're super fast, we got a great app for Fire Sticks, Android TVs, phones, laptops, or pretty much any other device you may use, and they're not expensive for such a premium service. In fact, they cost less than a cup of coffee per month, which is great pricing for us, the users. In the VPN app, you just connect to any server, let's say I will connect to France right now, and from the moment you connect, all your traffic is going to be totally encrypted. It means no one can track you or snoop on you online, and that's really important if you want to stay out of trouble. And if you don't have a VPN yet, but you want to try it out, I do have a great offer for you. If you use my link, which will be in a pinned comment below the video, or in the description of the video, you'll get 3 months of NordVPN totally for free, which is an amazing offer. And if you're watching this video on your TV or on your Fire Stick, then just grab your phone or your computer, open up a web browser and go to topvpnoffer.com. That's my website, which is going to give you the same amazing deal for NordVPN, with 3 months for free. Or just scan the QR code, which you can see on the screen right now with a camera of your phone. It works the same way and it's also going to give you the same deal for Nord. And now, finally, let's use the loader safely. So now we go to the list of apps on your device, open up the loader and wait until the app loads for you. Then here on the left side menu, it's very important that you click on home and not on browser. So once again, make sure that you have clicked on home and in that search bar we'll have to enter a link, which is going to be tvmate.com. So let's enter it together, once again it's tvmate. .com. Here we go, there is a link, you can see it on your screen right now, so make sure to enter it as you see, and do not make any mistakes, because obviously if you make a mistake, then the link is not going to work. After that, you have to click on go, and while the website is loading, make sure to subscribe my channel, so you would get even more content about Fire Sticks. 
as well as please hit the like button. It surely helps me a lot and this way I'll be able to create even more videos for you. And now, after the website has opened, we just need to scroll down a bit until we find that download APK button right here. Now we click on it and in a couple of moments the download is going to start. Usually it doesn't take long, but of course it all depends on the connection speed. Then just click on install and wait until TV made IP2 player gets installed on your Fire TV. And then, after it's installed, don't click on open yet, instead press on done, because this way we'll have an option to delete the installation files, as we don't need them anymore on your device. So click on delete and then delete once again. This way we get rid of unnecessary files from our fire stick and save yourself some free space on your device. And that's really important, because you don't have too much of free space on your device anyway. Then we go to the list of apps on your device, and there you'll find TV Made, which we just unloaded. Now, I would recommend you to click on the Options button on your remote. That's the button with three horizontal lines. Click on it and then press on Move to Front. This way, TV Made is always going to be at the very top of your application list, and therefore, it's going to be super easy for you to access the app every time you need it. Just don't forget to keep the VPN connected to stay safe and out of trouble. Then finally, we open the TV Made and just click on the Add Playlist button. And from here, it depends on your Wi-Fi TV provider, either they gave you an M3U link or extreme codes to use. So if your Wi-Fi TV provider gave you an M3U link, you would need to click on that button. Just enter the link here. After that, you click on Next and the playlist is going to appear in the list of your playlists in TV Mate application. Alternatively, if they gave you an extreme code, that's an option as well. You would need to enter the server address here and then the username and the password that were given to you by your IPTV provider. After that, just like previously, you click on next and the playlist is going to appear in the playlist list on your application. So that's how you can get TV Mate to your Fire Stick, which is one of the best and really stable IPTV players. And most importantly, it's totally free to use. So enjoy and see you next time. Bye bye.